Hello, hello, Oliver here. I just had somebody asking me, so Oliver, what is exactly that you do? What are the things that you do on a daily basis? So, as I was speaking with this person, I thought now that I would record a video and share it with you, if you in case you're wondering what is it exactly that I do on regular basis, on daily basis, I have a list here of 10 things that I do on regular basis. Some of these things are do it on everyday basis, on daily basis, and some of these things I do occasionally depending what's happening in my business and whether I'm here or in town, whether I'm traveling, etc. So, but no matter what, every day in the morning I review my task list, which I created the day or night before. So when I finish the day, I create a task list for the next day. And then I also take a look at the calendar and see if there's anything happening, if there's anything happening the first day, uh, if there's anything happening on that on this day. So this is the first thing. Um, number two, I check my calendar for any new appointments that maybe somebody scheduled with me, because I have automatic uh, appointment or a meeting scheduler, scheduler. And sometimes people will come across my videos, my content, and they may request to schedule a meeting with me, which I assign them certain hours that I'm available so I can give them a chance to speak with me and maybe take a look at my business, talk to me, uh, have, me maybe have me help them out or answer some questions and maybe consider me to work with me. So I see if there's any appointment scheduled for that day. Number three, I contact five to 15 people who ask me to, to work with me, who, who are who shown interest in, in a business or who showed interest to work from home or work online. So I have people sending me, uh, it's like a system where people reach out to me and they ask me to work with me. So uh, I have some ads, I have some uh, social media things uh, running. So they fill out the form and I receive these requests. It's like leads pretty much. And they uh, wanna find out what I do, how I do it. And, uh, and then I give them a call and then we see if you're a good match if what, the business that I have is a good match for them and if this is something that they're looking into. And then if, uh, if they're interested in what I have to offer and if I like who they are, then I help them get registered and get signed up with Forever Living Company and they become my business partner. Um, and then I record a video like this pretty much every day lately. I record, I record a video like this, video or two, and I put them on my social media channels, and I also put them on my me, uh, YouTube channel. So I grow my YouTube channel, so this is how many people find me, and then they want to work with me. Uh, number six, uh, I'm being social on social media. That's another thing that's important. If you're just posting and do, don't, you don't do anything else, then when you post, and if you're not connected, if you're not social, then these social media platforms will not show your content to many people. So if you want somebody to see your stuff on their feed, you may want to connect with them and be social and be, that's what the social media platforms are for. Number seven, I follow up with my prospects and I also follow up with my forever friends. And my forever friends are my forever business partners. So I get in touch with them. I see how the things are going. And uh, I also follow up with my prospects who said they will watch a video or who would attend one of our uh, master classes or presentations or trainings. So I follow up with them to make sure that I found out, find out if they had a chance to watch it. And then I can um, help them navigate them to the next steps that they need to take. Number eight, I plan events and meetings and things like that. Uh, that's, that's not always, but sometimes depending on what's happening. For example, we have upcoming event in Montreal. We have upcoming event in Calgary. So I'm going to be going to Calgary, going and flying to Calgary, going to Montreal, and then upcoming event in Phoenix. So I invite people to come. Right? If, you, if you don't invite, then many people will come. So I want to uh, invite them, let them know that we have these meetings 
in person. So I, I run my business online, um, we call it digital network marketing, but at the same time, it is also great to connect and meet with people in person so that um, uh, you help them better in, in a, you know, you, you have a chance to connect better pretty much and then share experiences and things like that. And, and then introduce products and, and uh, what we do and introduce products with our company and then help, have, have them uh, maybe for some guests to come in so that they can test and taste some of the products that we have. So it's pretty cool. I love uh, events in person because uh, you just make connections, better connections with people who are interested in the business. It's more transparent, it's real. So there's a lot of scam happening in the world. And um, when you have these live events, you have a chance to showcase that this is a real business, real company, we have real products and we work with uh, real, uh, real products and making real money. So people can see that. And then for those who are maybe concerned or, or, or question things, they can come to some of these uh, live events, in-person events, and, and, and find out more. And then another thing that I do is I learn new things all the time. I develop myself. I continuously either read or listen or sign up for some programs, trainings, attend uh, company events, uh, company, I plug into company presentations, webinars, uh, we have product trainings, we have uh, business trainings, and then also our industry and profession trainings. So these things, I always improve myself so that I better can help my forever friends and help them uh, grow their business better as well. And then at the end of the day, I create a list of items for next day. So these are the 10, ten things. Maybe I skipped uh, one or, or a few things there. Like, you know, using products or sometimes I have people coming up, coming here to pick up some of the products. Sometimes I have a, sometimes I have a delivery of some of our products, but mostly it's done to drop shipping. I ship them directly. I don't stock a lot of products, but I do have some products uh, on hand all the time because I have regular repeating customers who stop by and just pick up. They call me, hey, Oliver, I need my four aloe vera bottles of aloe vera gel. I need my toothpaste, I need to, I need my nutritional products. So they just stop by and buy products. So if I don't have it in stock, then I would have to order and wait <clears throat> and things like that. Because some people uh, prefer to order online while others, they prefer to just come in person and buy some products in person. And then um, uh, they're probably few things here and there depending on on uh, daily things what's happening what um, week of the month it is you know first week of the month may be different the last week of the month but uh, these are the core things that I do on regular basis which takes about three four five hours six hours of my day depending on what's happening all right so wanted to share what I do how I how I, how I work and if this is intriguing, if this is interesting, and if you maybe would like to consider and work like me or work with me, then feel, feel free to connect with me. I'm gonna drop a link under this video where you can learn more about me and where you can schedule a meeting with me, and then we can figure out whether we would be a good fit to work together. All right, thanks for checking this video, and uh, whether you connect with me or not, I do wish you all the best and all, I wish you all success, whether you are in forever living or not, I do wish you all the best. Bye-bye.